and welcome to Beverly Hillbillies Facts and Trivia. Appreciate you being here. Uh, before we get started, if you're brand new to this channel, or if you're old and you have not subscribed, please subscribe. When we get to a thousand subscribers, we will be doing a contest, a giveaway of such. I have yet to pick out the prize, but that will be forthcoming soon. So, make sure you subscribe, because you have to be subscribed to enter the contest. Uh, today's video is on how Buddy Epson inspired Mickey Mouse's dance moves. Let's take a look. Buddy Epson's career was more than just his role as Jed Clampett on the Beverly Hillbillies. In the popular sitcom, Epson plays the naive and head of the Clampett family, and that usually sets things straight. He is one of the three characters that actually appeared in every single Beverly Hillbillies episode. Uh, beyond his career as an actor, he was a phenomenal comedian and dancer. Began dancing career uh, in the Broadway Melody of 1936. He was also in Captain January, The Wizard of Oz. They met in Argentina, Sing Your Worries Away, and Breakfast at Tiffany's. His role in The Wizard of Oz actually led to some aluminum dust in his lungs. His successful television career actually began with Walt Disney production. That is, he was George Russell in the Davy Crockett miniseries in 1953. Later in life, he also became known for saving the day as Barnaby Jones. While his acting surely had an influence, so did, times, so did his times dancing and singing around the stage. According to MeTV, he once demonstrated his dance moves to Walt Disney. It was around the time he was in Broadway Melody of 1936, in one portion of the film, he's even dancing and shaking with a classic Mickey Mouse sweatshirt on. This is because his moves would go on to inspire Mickey Mouse in Silly Symphony cartoons. Then he once again showed up in front of his creative buddy Walt Disney years later in 51. This time he was filmed in front of a gridded white wall. He, looked me, he took me to a room where there were seven little guys with aprons and thick glasses working on a contrivance had pulled wires and little mechanical man that moves his arms, legs, head, and mouth. Epson told BBC Obituary, according to his BBC Obituary. His moves were turned into robot companions that sit near visitors on rides at Disney World. The project became audio animatronics. Uh, specifically, Buddy Epson's lanky dance moves would be recognizable at, part, at Pirates of the Caribbean, uh, Haunted Mansion, and Great Moments with Mr. Lincoln. The famous attractions have a direct tie to the Beverly Hillbillies. So, if you're ever at Disneyland, check them out. And uh, when you see him, you say, Uncle Jed. Bob said, hey, that's all I got for you. Um, if you're into faith-based uh, movies and such, uh, head on over to Faith and Entertainment. It's another channel of mine. It's, uh, the, link are in, the links are in the description below this video on YouTube. Take you over there. I'll be doing a series starting today on The Chosen, the best TV series that's on television today. Bar none. I'm, I'm on my 11th time through watching this. Uh, so far, two seasons are out. Season three is coming at the end of the year. So what I'm doing is I'm explaining each episode what's going on in each episode uh, it's kind of difficult to get into it at first but once you do oh my lord literally um and i'll be talking about behind the scenes stuff and the actors and the creator and all that and if you uh, when while you're there you can check out some of the other videos that uh, are about uh, faith-based movies and such uh the ones I, I really like and there's there's quite a few there anyway if you want to go see that, go down in the link, go down to the description below this video on YouTube, and the links will be there. Appreciate it. Uh, have a great day. God bless. I'll be praying for you.